The timeline for medical marijuana sales in Kentucky has been moved up following Governor Bashir's signing of House Bill 829. The bill expedites the licensing process for all avenues of the medical cannabis business, allowing cultivators to begin growing in July. However, many have concerns over stipulations in the bill. The legalizing medical marijuana in the state of Kentucky, never been done before, uh, first time. It will be legal as of 2025 of January 1st. I want it to be fair. You know, I want it for anybody that wants to try to do this. And one thing I've noticed with the beginning things of $3,000, non-refundables, brick and mortar shop, uh, the one that we seen, I mean, you are talking hundreds of dollars. We're not Lexington, Louisville. We're Eastern Kentucky. Now, I'm not saying certain, but you know, no one has. I'm just saying the reality is all of these non refundable amounts, where's all that go? Does it go to the board? Does it go to pay this? Does it that? But yeah, they're going legal. Um, I just want it fair. Appalachian Wireless, where your connections matter the most. Right now, get up to $550 off select devices on new or renewed line with the Appalachian Unlimited or Mix and Mash plan. Offer good in-store only. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The bill also prohibits those with a felony record from receiving a medical marijuana card. In addition to the limited qualifying conditions in which there are only eight, smoking the plant is not only prohibited but still a felony in the Commonwealth and if caught will result in the loss of your card and potential prosecution. However, edibles, oils, and tinctures will be available for purchase at dispensaries across the state. I think it's going to help a lot of people. Um, you know, what was it, a year ago or two years ago, you know, the governor done the executive orders where you can go out of state and possess, you know, but you couldn't buy it in Kentucky. And uh, those steps were done. Now it's going to give them a choice. It's going to be a, you know, it's a choice. Uh, you know, we see a lot of people that come in here on a daily basis. They're not taking their medications for pain. They're not taking their medications anymore for migraines. And uh, it's always been pharmaceutical or something that is a supplement. Now you will have a choice if you are wanting to legally obtain it, use it, Kentucky, you'll be allowed to come January 1st, 2025. Qualifying patients can expect to wait about 30 to 45 days to receive their card once the program is launched. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.